All right, guys, check this thing out on my net. This is an artificial sex pheromone lure for Seceed Clearway moths. Guys, I'm after Paranthrini simulans. That's the big oak. It's like a hornet. It looks like a hornet uh, or a yellow jacket or something. I'm going to show one to you. I guarantee it. Guys, I'm in Central Florida, springtime. I've got the artificial sex pheromone. We're going to see what kind of Seceed clearling, clear wing moths will come to this. Maybe show you some mimicry in action. Guys, want to see how a moth protects itself using mimicry? Check this video out. All right, guys. Wasp or moth? I was, I thought it was a moth. The more I look at it. It's, I don't know. No, that's a moth, bro. Is that? I don't know. No, it's a fly. Oh, I'm catching you. What the heck are you? It's a fly. It's not a wasp. Oh. Okay, that's a moth. All right, guys, in my net, I have... Okay, check this out, guys. In my net, I have a big male Paranthrini simulans. That right there is a moth. It came to my pheromone. I must show you the, the other thing that it's in there with. I don't know if it bites or not, but I have to get... I have to get this moth in a jar. Hold on a second. Okay. Moth in the jar. Fly in the jar. All right. <laughs> I can't wait to show you guys this. Check this out, guys. If that's not mimicry, <laughs> incredible. I'm gonna show you guys this later with tweezers. You're not gonna believe this, how, how closely these things look alike. It's incredible. Parent three simulans, man. It's been a while, finally got one. All right guys, I wanted to show you guys something. This is the, um, Paranthrini simulans, the oak borer that I got in Central Florida. And I wanted to show you the Hymenoptera mimic that I caught at, literally at the same spot. Check this out. So I had to put my flash on. <laughs> uh, th this little Hymenoptera right here, I had found this on the Sparkleberry and that looks like it's something that will sting you. And then this came to my pheromone lure. This is like, the mimicry here is, is just sick, dude. It's, look at that thing. Does that not look like a wasp? It's got the yellow and black bands on the hind wing, on the abdomen. The, the wings are transparent. Well, the forewing has some scales, but... Hind wings transparent. Flies during the day. It looks identical to this wasp mimic here or this Hymenoptera. So as you can see, this is a phenomenal example of mimicry in the Lepidoptera world where this moth right here, Paranthrene simulans, looks and acts just like a wasp or other hymenopterans in its area. So uh, guys, hope you liked the video. This is a pretty cool example of mimicry in, look at that thing, man, it's so cool. And that, that's actually a big, that's actually a big specimen now. That's a, that's a large, a large moth, but it is a moth, not a wasp. Uh, so cool. Guys, thanks so much. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Till next time, let's get out there and enjoy South Florida, Central Florida, or wherever you can find cool critters like this. Take care.